these guys right here are the Hawaiian red shrimp, sometimes called the lava shrimp, and sometimes in the native tongue called the opeuala shrimp. And basically these are what are considered extremophiles. So these are little tiny shrimp, and they're very small. They're usually less than an inch. And they exist almost solely. They're endemic to Hawaii, which means they don't live anywhere else in the world. And they live almost solely in these pools created by fresh lava flows. And they are really, really tolerant of very extreme environments. So whether that be the salinity of the water, the temperature of the water, or the existence of food at all. So they live in this shrimp bubble here at the St. Louis Zoo, and I feed them about once every three to five weeks. So they eat almost nothing. Um, they are very, very good at surviving in very extreme environments. So these guys are detritivores, which means they basically will eat almost anything. They're scavengers. They're the cleanup crew. Um, and because they live in such extreme environments, there is a massive scarcity of food. They have almost nothing to eat. So a lot of their natural diet is bits of algaes and any kind of like cast off debris that happens to fall into these little pools. The things that live in these very extreme environments do actually tend to live pretty impressively long lives. Now these guys right here can live upwards of 14 years. Our goal here in the invertebrate department is to showcase and talk about and educate about invertebrates. It is just an interesting story that these animals can exist in such a wild environment. The fact that they live in fresh lava flow pools is really impressive.